I think it's going to be a pretty good uh, election as far as participation goes. Time. So we have dummy ballots out here. There's, um, this is a manual that everybody uh, works through and they keep them with them on election day so if they have questions about anything. Can you educate me a little bit on Albert sensors? Well, just a little bit. Um, mm -hmm. It's something that's used to detect attempts to intrude into our system. Can you let me in the tabulation room? And there are people and entities who on a regular basis are trying to penetrate the system. So far, no one has been successful. The work that you may see going on around here is to add more physical security to our location. George. Yes, ma'am. This is a general. Well, what happens is um, I believe we have a daily checking of our firewalls and of the attempts on the Albert server. And um, our IT director is able to identify by name or origin those groups or individuals who are trying to penetrate the system. And there are folks out there who want to uh, uh, do damage to our system so that it prevents people from participating. Ballots that have come back from the early voting sites, and so those are ballots from all the tw 22 sites. The Albert Sensor is an intrusion detection system that we run on our network. Uh, yeah, absolutely, it's exciting. We get to see if uh, there's any attempts of a compromise on our network, and so that's monitored 24/7, 365. How does and, it show you that? How do you how do you see an attempt? Uh, there's alerts. There's traffic on the network that we look at. If there's uh, if there's something that looks fishy, the system tells us that it's fishy, and we look at it, and we investigate, and we drill down into those packets of information that are attempting to do whatever they're attempting to do, and then we attack it at that point to make sure it's not malicious. The Valo. Oh well, the vulnerability is if they get into the system, they can attack our uh, voter registration system uh, where all the voter records are held. And obviously that could create chaos for us on election day from a from a uh, voter perspective. Uh, that's about all they could do. Yeah.